Welcome back. I'm here with uh, Jeff Parling as the England team are just arriving. Uh, Jeff, this is the first evening kickoff of this series. What are the emotions as, as a player when you arrive here at Twickenham ahead of a match? There's just so much excitement. You, you just buzz in and the main thing is now you're here, you're at the stadium, you can get on with the game now and you've been waiting around all day, the apprehension is building and you're just excited to get out there. Everybody here is absolutely thrilled to see the England team arrive. Uh, just tell us about uh, a few of the changes that Stuart Lancaster has made. First of all, George Ford comes in at number 10. What do England want to see from him today? Just good control, just to do what he does. He's been picked because he's a very good player. We want to tend to control the game, manage it right, and get that attack flowing as well. And I'm sure we'll see a big game from George Ford. Six changes in total, one positional. Uh, how important are the 8, 9, 10, 12 combinations? Yeah, the spine of the team, there's a lot of familiarity in there. Obviously, Fordy and Ben Youngs did each other well from, from Leicester and, and Owen Farrell and George Ford you know, played a lot together in the age groups there. So well, I think that spine of the team is, is looking really strong and they should know each other like, like, you know, like the brothers. What do you make of the changes up front? Well, look, we've come in. Um, James Haskell's been outstanding all all season. Um, a, bit, a big chance for him. Rob Bevers come in at hooker to see what he can do, and then Ben Morgan, who made a massive impact off the bench last week, he's in there again. But I think the pack will just want to set that platform, and it's about everybody, the whole collective, getting in and getting going. And don't forget to join in the conversation using the hashtag #O2InsideLine. We'll see you later on for post-match analysis.